The Indian Army, on Thursday issued the Request for Information RFI, to finalize the specifications for acquiring 1,750 Futuristic Infantry Combat Vehicles FICVs, under the Make in India initiative, to destroy enemy tanks, and to carry troops. The Army has issued a request for information to identify probable Indian vendors who are capable of commencing supply of the tracked FICVs within two years of the contract being inked, with at least 70 to 100 fully formed vehicles per year. The Indian Army says it wants to deploy the vehicles in places like Eastern Ladakh along with desert and amphibious terrain such as found in the Western Front with Pakistan. The FICV project has been in plans for a long time, and the need for a modern troops carrier equipped with tank-busting capabilities was felt during the recent Ladakh conflict. This is the second such RFI to be issued in recent days. The Army earlier this month saw the response of foreign armament companies for another proposed Mega Make in India project for induction of 1770 future ready combat vehicles in phase manner. Due to the experiences in the Ladakh theater, the Indian Army is also looking at the prospect of acquiring 350 light tanks in a phased manner, along with performance-based logistics, niche technologies, engineering support package, and other maintenance and training requirements. The light tank is planned to be procured under the Make in India Ethos and Spirit of the Defense Acquisition Procedure DAP, of 2020, the Indian Army has stated. The Indian Army specified that it wants at less than 25 tons tanks to be used for operations in high altitude area, marginal terrain, amphibious operations, etc. The advancement in technology also facilitates that the light tank is having weapon systems and protection of adequate capacity and is equipped suitably to operate in current slash future threat spectrum to support combat operations as a weapon system. The RFI issued on April the 23rd said that FICVs should have an operational life of at least 32 years, with maximum one overhaul or repair intervention, and be capable of being transported by existing in-service tank transporters vehicles of the Indian Army, IAF transport aircraft and broad-gauge railway military bogies.